What's going on, Giants fans? Welcome back to another episode of G Nation Inside Sports. And today I'm excited to talk to you about the chemistry, the feel, the energy that the New York Giants have in the building and training camp. And, and it's just phenomenal. I don't know about you, but I'm excited. Saquon looks 100% ready. Uh, Daniel Jones looks hungry. Wandell Robinson looks like he's everything we thought he would be coming out of the draft. Kadarius Tony is looking way better, like he's actually grasping the playbook and he's actually bought in to what the coaching staff is, is uh, selling out there. So, you know, with that being said, I'm, I'm excited about the chemistry, the winning culture that's being developed. Whether people want to hate and, and shout out to Big Pat for his inspirational video last night, it, it was um, some truths in there that needed to be told and a lot of stuff that a lot of negative and pessimistic people needed to hear. Um, I myself have been screaming 11 to 6 for two seasons now. Has it happened? No. Um, am I excited that it hasn't happened? Am I happy that it hasn't happened? No. But am I down in this team talking trash about them, uh, trying to kick our players out the door? No, I am not. That is my team. I root for that team. As long as you wear that NY logo on your jersey, I'm a, I'm here for you. I'm going to cheer for you. I'm going to hope that you do the best. Now, um, I just want to – touch on something real quick because a lot of people ain't paying attention to the actual chemistry the actual energy the actual moods and and the way that people are interacting interacting with each other not just the offensive group and the defensive groups interacting within their own respective groups no i'm talking about the offense and the defense who battle against each other all week long actually have a respect for each other, a camaraderie with each other. They all want the best for each other. You'll see the offense after a play telling the defender where he messed up. You'll see a defender after the play telling the offense how it was that he wasn't able to beat him on a route or whatever. So, so you see the communication, you see the team building, you see the chemistry. These guys have bought in. Whatever Shane and Dabble are doing over there, it's working. Now, people can say that, oh, we haven't played a game yet. How can you say that? Um, games need to be played in order for chemistry to be built. That is not so. Chemistry starts in the training in training camp, film room, uh, office meetings, you know, those, those uh, little dinners together, going out to the movies together, doing things as a group, not on the field, not at Quest Diagnostics. All that stuff starts team building, camaraderie, winning coaches all developed in multiple places. You don't have to play a game to develop winning culture. But with that being said, let me go ahead and hit, kick the intro off real quick, and then we'll get into the uh, video that I want. Super Bowl champs. That sounds so beautiful. That sounds so, so beautiful. But now, what I wanted to get into right here was uh, this little training camp highlight. It ain't long. It's just a minute. But I want you to pay attention to an offensive player walking towards a defensive player. These guys battle all week, okay? These guys all right, have come together. They're helping each other. They're competing against each other. They're giving each other pointers. They're, they're teaching each other, making each other better. There's a proverb that says iron sharpens iron. Now, you guys all play for the same team. We wear that same logo. We sweat and run the same drills, okay? If I'm a DB and I stopped you from running your route, but you on my team at the end of the day, it only benefits me to tell you why I was able to stop you from running your route. So in the event that you come against that same look against another opponent that's not of our team, you know how to beat him. You know how to make sure that he doesn't do what I did to you in this practice to negate you from getting your route. That is the type of camaraderie and team building and winning culture that you are seeing right now. These guys are not being egotistical. These guys are not being greedy. They are all in, and they are playing for 
the New York Giants. They're not playing for themselves or personal records or personal statistics. These guys have bought in. And I, for one, can't wait to see how we come out the gate in week one against Tennessee. I look forward to it. I can't wait to see it. So that's just a short little video I had to put out there because a lot of people are not talking about the team building, the chemistry, and the winning culture that is being developed here. You guys already know what to do. Hit that like, subscribe, and that thumbs up button for me. Hit that bell notification so you will be alerted every time that I post a video. And leave your comments, thoughts, opinions, and ideas in the comment section. I will always get back to you in some way or another. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe. And until next time, as always, 